Welcome back to Lutra FM. Thank you for the people that watched last uh, yesterday's episode and previous episodes, episodes before that. Much appreciated. Um, thank you for your continual support. Where you left off last, we were third in the league. We, I think we played, this is all the games that we played here last, last episode. So these, these five games here. So we played Ipswich and we won 5-2. We played um, Norwich, we lost 2-1. We beat Coventry 4-0, drew Bristol City 0-0, and we beat Swansea 1-0. Yeah, we're currently third with 23 points after 11 games played. Um, we didn't have a game for two weeks, so our holiday is until then. Unfortunately, McCallum picked up an injury. He's out for about five or six weeks, which is not good. But other than that, we were quite lucky to avoid many injuries. So this is the lineup. Defence and goalkeeper as usual. Norton Cuffey is right back. And um, we've got Tymon in there. So we'll just swap him, put him in his best role. Garnier. Garnier is a Carrillo. That's his best role. So we've got him and Anderson. Anderson is obviously a Masada. Um, Elanini isn't there. So I think he might be injured and I might not reload. I oh, know he's on the bench. We'll give him a rest. Adosi and uh, Lavumbo as usual on the wings and Marshall up front. Oh yeah, let's just get cracking here against Cogman and against QPR. Sorry. Hopefully, we can start this episode with a bang, with a nice little victory. We did beat QPR in the Carabao Cup at the start of the season. We, I think, we absolutely thrashed them from what I remember, but I could be wrong. Right, so we've got the first highlight now. Garner back in the team. Mika Marmo, beautiful little pass to Norton Cuffey. Norton Cuffey with a chip cross. Their defence gets rid of it. Back to Anderson now. Switches it up. Gets the ball back to Garner. Garner with a lovely little pass. Back, we should have gone forward, not backwards there, lads. Come on. Uh, defensive area here by the looks of it. And we nearly score. Good save by their goalkeeper. Um, just let me know in the comments and things like that if the audio's okay. I've changed the setting on my mic, so I'm hoping it sounds better. How was that? Um, yeah, so just let me know. Also, as well, let me know if the webcam looks all right in the right position. And that because I know I scrunch down when I'm playing the game because the lap my webcam is um on top of my laptop, so I have to sometimes look up when I'm trying to get my point across to you lot on the screen. But then most of the time, I've got my head down playing the game, so you you just have to let me know if that's a bit off putting to you as a uh, watcher. You don't mind but yeah let me know in the comments i haven't had a comment yet on any of my videos yet so it'd be nice to have some comments so it makes it feel like people um are enjoying it but also just give me feedback because I any feedback i appreciate right holgate with the ball passes it back still near nil after 20 minutes playing we have been the better team they haven't i don't think they've had any uh major attacks yet oh okay tried to catch the goalkeeper off early there managed just to save it we're now on the corner, Lovumbo. What can you do with this? Crosses the ball. We head it. They head it out. We get the ball back. Adosi. Hyman is uh, Naku, so we've got to take him off. Oh, what's going on here? What? Yeah, this is a bit of a... Oh, it was going to be one of them comedy defend, uh, defender situations there where we score. Right, Norton Cuffey. Right, Laird comes on for Hyman. Probably do with another left back, really, to be honest. But I'm not going to go crazy to sign one. I think, to be honest, I think we're quite we're quite good. We've got a quite a decent squad. We've got we've got players that can uh, come in and do the job. So uh, we're not going to go crazy. We might just save the money, and not bother in the January transfer window. We'll just assess it if, uh, before the window, see where we need to improve if we do. Which I've done quite regularly in my Newcastle save on Twitch. Good little cross there. Beautiful goal by Martial. See, when Martial's fit, he can get the goals. That's what frustrates me um, with him at Man United as a Man United fan. Frustrating because you know Martial on his day can, can be one of the best strikers in the world. He knows he knows how to score, but it's just it's motivation, it's his fitness that lets him down. It's um, yeah, it's it's a bit frustrating. He's he's going to be one of them 
what if what if Martial was better with his fitness, better with in his injury record. Oh, nearly. Right, so one nil up at coming towards the end of half time. First half, sorry. Uh Anderson is injured. So we've had two injuries in the first half, which is not ideal. We do that. And we'll do uh ball winner midfield defender. Defensive. Right, half time. Two injured, two players injured. We've had to make two substitutions ready, but we're winning one 0 thanks to Martial. So Lumbo Maria with the cross. We just head it wide. Right, Laird with the throw in. Garner, Garner passes it back to Laird. Laird comes across, pass it to Norton Cuffey. Norton Cuffey with a nice little pass to Lavumbo, and Lavumbo scores. Good, 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 good. Going to take a dosy off. He's not playing well. We're going to put Conway on. Hopefully, he won't get sent off this time. Uh, Conway is best position. So we're 2 0 up. Goals from Martial and Lavumbo. I think we'll just, there won't be much happening in the next 20 minutes of this game, I think. I think it will be slowly dying off. Um, we're still third if the, if, the, if the results end this way. We're still third. Three points behind Birmingham, we're second, and then. Sheffield United are top with 30 points, so they're four points clear of us at the moment. We're still in with the shout. We've still, we still got plenty of time. It's only a few months into the season, so we've still got plenty of time. The Lumbo now drives it forward on the wing, gets tackled but keeps possession, crosses it in. Oh, nearly. Conway with the header there, I think. The Lumbo. Do not want Lavumbo being injured. We can't make any more subs. We can't make any more subs. What possible injuries he got? Potential groin injury. That'll be him out for a few weeks, huh? Right, turn out. At least we win. We've got to win. We've got a few injuries, though. Now let's have a quick look. Right, so Lavumbo's out for three to four weeks with a uh, poor groin after sprinting. Anderson's out for three weeks with a poor groin as well. Uh, Arnon's out for two weeks with a twisted knee. That's two of our left backs out injured now, which is not good. Right, so we're back. Um, what we had to do was basically call up um, 16 year old there. Yeah. Oh, okay. Annoyingly, because I had a meeting, they decided to uh, put him back in the under 28, under 18, but we need to have him in the first team. So we're going to have to call up this guy here, Javi Berenger, who's actually very highly rated play for our youth team at the moment. Uh, he came through last season's youth intake when I took over. Oh, yeah, so he is a, a cover in in defence here because we've got injuries to two of our left backs, Tymon and uh, McCallum. So we we probably have him. He might be on the bench. He might not be, but no, he's not. So um, if we get an injury to Laird, we'll just have to play Marmo on there. So uh, um, it's not ideal because he's not a natural left back, I don't think. But yeah, so we're uh, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. But yeah, so the lineup: Patterson, defense is basically the same. We've got Laird in for McCallum. Uh, midfield is slightly different because we're playing Carney and Garner. We've got Dosi and Lado on the wings today, and then we've got Marshall up front. Uh, another cold winter day. I'm trying to get my hands warm. Easier said than done. 
I would put my thermal gloves on, but I think it would um, hinder me when it comes to being on my laptop right now. So I'm just warm my hands up the old fashioned way, rub them together. Anyway, right, Adosi loses the ball. Durati, is that Anderson Durati? Better not be. He's bloody good, he is. Sheffield United look like they've been the better team in the first 17 minutes of the game. We now have a corner. Garner. And we score. Still got the ball though. Baird. If it loops it over. Lado to Norton Cruffy. Norton Cruffy is the post. Oh. We really could do with getting the first goal in this game. Settle it up, settle it a bit. Good save by Patterson. Good double save by Patterson there. All right, can we, uh, can we, can we, can we shout, please? I don't like FM muting me, thank you. I'll give my players a shout, encourage them. All right, Lado sends it across to Laird. Laird nearly gets tackled by Girati. Laird drives it forward now, passes it in to Carney. Carney misses. And we do, uh, you know, shout. There we go. All right, encourage. I get annoyed by that. Why can't you just? I don't understand that. You wouldn't be like it wouldn't be that in real life. If the manager wants to shout uh, something to the players, he'll shout. It really drives them mad. But there's no reason for FN to do that. You'd be able to shout whenever you want. That's what I say. Um, right. So we probably slightly the better team. No, they didn't. Chef. It's been it's been like an, an even match at the moment. I'd say. Right, I'm going to courage again. That doesn't work. Then I'm going to demand more. I don't know what the hell happened there with that. We've got the ball. Adosi comes forward. Would he shoot? Ah, oh, come off their player, I think. Oh, no, come off ours. Right, okay. Sheffield United possession now. I'll throw in former PSV defender, Martin Zadil. Or was he throwing all? I can't remember. No, I think it was PSV. Right, we get the ball back. Garner. Porteous. Porteous passes it back to Garner. Garner, who's, who's very good at passing, gives it to Carney. Carney across to Norton Cuffey. Norton Cuffey now. Floats the ball in. Great little ball. Great little goal. I think that's what we need to do, really, is by young English um, British players playing for the bigger teams. So get them when they're not really they're just in the youth team and then buy them. I mean, he did cost us a fair bit, but he's been really good. Um, 13, just over 13 million for him. But he's been really good so far, Norton Cuffey. He's probably been, I'd probably say, our best player in, of, of the season so far, him and McCallum. Um, but yeah, four assists, one goal in 10 games, and he's, he's, been, he's always performed well. Yeah, 1-0 up. We could do with, we're going to make some substitutions. Uh, I don't see you all coming off. On way on. There. No, he doesn't play there. We'll put him there. Um, that's playing maker support. Take off Garner because he's knackered. We play as a Carrillo. They're off as a ball playing defender. Ball winning defender, defend. There we go. Sorry. Sometimes I'm bumble, by the way. I apologize. I'm, not, I'm trying to eliminate that. Right. Martial, even though he's not injured, he's coming off because he's playing rubbish. Horace Campbell comes back into the team. Can we make any more substitutions? I don't think we can. Leave this up for now. Right. Oh, we can make more substitutions. Okay, we'll do that. Mason Knight comes on for. I can't remember who he comes on for now. Um, yeah, left back for a little bit. I don't know, let's say. Anyway, we won 1 0. Sometimes I go off on a tangent as well, if you haven't noticed. So we're now one point behind Sheffield United. Um, 13 games played. We overtook Birmingham City. I'll be happy with second. I'll be ecstatic if we get first. I feel like we should get first, considering the amount of money we spent the and the team that we've got. Hey, Garner, a million pounds. Right, so we'll be back in a minute for the next game against Blackburn. 
Right, so we're back now. We've got Blackburn. Um, we basically raided Blackburn and most of their best players. And also Adam Morton went to West Ham or somebody in the end. So they're, they're not going to have the squad that they used to have, but they're still a team that we need to be aware of. Um, so this is the lineup. Defence as usual. Um, Malmo is playing left back in this game, which he can do actually. So we'll leave him as that. Um, Garners and Carney in the middle of uh, midfield. Lado stays on the right. Josi on the left. Marshall up front. Not a bad little polo top, by the way, this. Um, fits me nicer than the Newcastle top I've got. I've got yeah, nice little embroidery badge there. Um, yeah. And it cost me about five quid. There was somebody selling a few Everton different polos. There's this one. There's another athletic-looking one. Um, hopefully, if I, if I lose a bit more weight, they, they'll, they'll feel and look a bit better on me at the moment, a bit too... Uh, I mean, granted, I am wearing a big jumper underneath this because it's freezing. So it probably would fit me better if I didn't have that. Good goal there by Lado. Lado uh, putting a bit of pressure on uh, Lovumbo, showing us that that he can do the job when Lovumbo is not playing. That's good. Good to know that we've got him there who can play there as well. Yeah, 1 0 up just before the end of the first half. Will we get another highlight to us before the end of the first half? Can we get another goal just to settle the nerves a little bit? Whenever it's 1 0, I always think that the other team's got a chance. So we'll see. Dosi sprints across, gives it to Carney. Carney goes past with ease, glides like a gazelle, but shoots like a, um, an idiot. I don't know. I couldn't think of a, a clever word. Shoots like an idiot. There you go. Flies like a gazelle, shoots like an idiot. Carney, 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 Kukuranka. Let's get that on a t-shirt, shouldn't we? He'll be, he'll be, he'll be happy that people have got his name on the shirt, but he'll be, he'll be baffled what it means. Um, Godfrey now. Garner, Godfrey. Little back heel there for Garner. Garner, oh, that was a beautiful bit of techers there by Garner. Absolutely mugged him off there. All right, Adosi. Lovely little pass to Martial. Martial with his sixth goal of the season now. Six goals coming towards the, um, the end of October. Pretty good return so far. How many games has he played this season? He's played nine games. And he's, he's played ten games and scored six goals, basically. So um, it's not. It's a pretty good return. Right, we've got a free kick. Garner with the free kick. He is pretty good at taking free kicks. Floats it in just over the bar, though. I jinxed you, Garner. Sorry. Uh, do we substitute in Lado? Do that. Oh, corner header over the bar. Right, let Campbell comes on for Lado. Um, Norton Cuffey probably could do with a rest, so we'll put Laird on. Uh, Arnie is a bit tired as well, so we'll put Decoria on. Then we'll put we'll take Godfrey off and we'll put Du and Zebra. There you go, quadruple substitution. Let's hope we don't get any injuries now. I feel like that was a, a, a um, ball by us then. All right, Blackburn in possession. Good save by our goalkeeper there. Good reactions by Patterson. Patterson's been a really good signing as well. Never heard of him until I. Start this save. Um, Sunderland fans, let me know on the comments page. Is Patterson as good in real life as he is on FM in this save? Or is it just a, a blip? Garner. Tuman Zebe. Laird. Dukari. All the substitutes linking up together. Now to Garner. Thought he was going to turn then and shoot. Right, Porteous now. Just building up possession slowly here, wasting a bit of time, counting the clock down, I think, before we pull the bullet. Laird pushes it past. Oh, Campbell nearly scored then. 
Right, corner to Escana. See if he can pick up that beautiful pass that he knows how to do. Short pass in the box to Adosi. Adosi across to Martial. Martial shoots outside the box if it's their defence. Blocks them now, drives it forward, and the counter attack for Blackburn. Um, I didn't realise we had another substitute, so we're just going to take off um, a dosi, I think it was, and we'll put on Conway for the last bit of the game. Fortius now, just probably just going to do a bit of time wasting here. Two curry, the two runs Eve, just walking the ball, taking the mick here, some proper shit shithousery there. Campbell. Who ends every loser the ball? That'll teach you for being a shit house, won't it? Blackburn punishing him. Laird comes to his rescue. Passes it to Campbell now. Campbell straight in the middle to Ducari. Ducari loses the ball though. Yeah, substitutes aren't exactly doing very well in here, really. Right. Um, Blackburn with the ball now. Hedges. We tackle him. They get the ball back though. And they score. I can see that happening in the Marla. Right, we need to shut shop now. So what we need to do is go defensive and we need to waste a bit of time. Um, be more disciplined with our passing. We're already playing for set pieces. Okay. Oh, great. Here they go. That was saved by Patterson. Thank you. I thought, it, I, thought I was going to get FM'd here. But I know they're doing well. They've been doing well to get this back in, get them back in the game. Edges with the corner. We defend it well. Martial on his own now. What can he do? Waiting for players to come along and help him. Passes it. No. Yeah. Oh, he loses the ball. He still get. Oh, no. He gets it back. Drives forward. I'm amazed how much he's running. Probably going to get injured now. Um, he doesn't want that ball. He's, I think he's knackered. I think he's gone. No. Got me hamstring in again. He'll be out for three weeks now, Martial. He played one game in four. Oh, lovely. Prove me wrong there. Prove me wrong, Martial. Yeah, don't celebrate too vigorously, mate. We don't want you injured. Well done. 3 1. Good little result. We're still second, though. We, uh, we could do a Shep playing Sheffield United again. Yeah, we're doing well. Yeah, we've got some Villa in the next round of the Carabao Cup. Um, we're just going to praise Marshall. And we'll be back shortly with the Carval Cup game. We're back now. We've got Aston Villa in the Carval Cup. As always, in the Carval Cup, we'll play a full rotated squad. Um, McCallum makes his return from injury. Probably won't play the whole game because he's just coming back. Um, Elanini is a ball winning in there. Masala is there. Um, Carney is in his position. We're going to give Bering a uh, debut. Um, position is he best? No, we won't do that. We won't do that. Do you know what we're going to do? We're going to do more rotation. Yeah, there we go. We're going to do more rotation. So it's a bit more. Some players are get. Some players are coming like you know, getting a rest, but it's it's mostly an unchanged team. Um, Bazuno's coming in for. For Patterson, our defence is basically the same. Laird was right back, Mar uh, Marmol left back, Elanini in centre midfield with Carney, Lado on the wing, with, and Carlin Grant is going to make his debut. He's an inside forward support, so we'll change that. There we go. And Campbell is uh, attacking forward, so there we go. Right, let's see what happens. I would have gone full rotation, but they were playing, they were basically playing. McCallum, who's not back, not back yet from injury, and then playing a fullback in the centre of defence, so it just didn't make sense, really. You don't want to put that pressure on a 16-year-old. Is he on the suspension there? Yeah, he's on the suspension. So I probably will give him his debut in the cup at some point. Put him on for Marmo. Um, first highlight of the game, though, the Miller, but we get the ball. Marmo. With a lofty ball over, doesn't doesn't go where it needed to go. Oh, okay. Angel Career playing for Villa in this save. He's playing for for the mighty Newcastle United in my Twitch save. He did very well in the first season, doing okay in the second season, and he's not he's not been able to perform as well as he did in the last one. 
but then he's not playing as much because I've got Lionel Messi for Newcastle, who's basically starting right winger for us. Yes, yeah, so the the Lionel Messi I managed to sign him somehow in um, the second season. But yeah, Godfrey drives it forward, loses the ball. El Nini couldn't get it. We get it back with Holgate, passes it back to Basuno. Basuno now to Porteous. Porteous. Oh, I thought he was going to lose the ball then. I was getting worried. We're playing a bit too uh, nervously here. Godfrey now to Carney. Carney to Lado. Right, Grant now with the corner. Can he make an impact on his first game here? Nice little cross, goes over there. Carney with the ball. Former Aston Villa youth academy player. Went on to play for, went on to go to Chelsea. Aston Villa doing quite well at the moment, producing really good young players. They sell them though, which is annoying. Because they got him, uh, Chukwanga, and they also got... Um, Jacob Philogene Badashi, who went to Hall, who's a very good player. I assume they have either clauses or buyback clauses in there for Badashi. I don't think they have for Carney, but they did get a good fee for Carney, though. I think they got, I think they got a ridiculous amount of money for him, actually, to be honest. Oh, 16 million for a player who only played like 14 games for him. Um, who's not guaranteed to be a complete success. He's doing, I think he's doing okay at Chelsea in real life. He has played a few games. Not a starter by all means, but he is playing a few games. Villa with the first goal. Lado is knackered. So we'll put on, on a Shaftman. Okay, Malmo is knackered, so we'll put on Beringer. So Beringer is going to play his first game for us. Or uh, Beringua, Bering, maybe. Any Spanish speaking people, please let me know the proper pronunciation for it. Right, Villa look like the better team so far. We've only had a few shots. Um, they're not really in this game. But. Like I said, it wasn't our main priority. Obviously, it'd be nice for us to get as far as we can in there, but at the end of the day, our main concern is getting promoted this season. Good little save there by the Zunu. We've still got a chance. It's only 1-0. As long as we don't concede, we've still got a chance with, with 10 minutes to go. So you never know. Good up with the corner, though. The Wender taking a hell of a long time to do the corner. Proper taking the nick, I think. Clear it for a throw into them. No nonsense there by Laird, former Birmingham City player. So the fans probably love him. Oh well, that's us out the Carabao Cup. Right then. Um, we'll be back in a minute for the last game of the episode. We're back. Um, just before we go through the lineup for the Southampton game, we're just going to show you a few uh, inbox items that I come across earlier. Bear with us. So, Norton Buffy wins the Player of the Month, Championship Player of the Month, and he also wins the Young Player of the Month as well. So, that's really good for him. I'm just going to praise his recent form, I think, because he deserves a, a recent form. There we go. So he's extra happy. And I, Ronaldo Beckham, win the manager of the month. Um, I tried to scroll down the inbox to see if I can find it, but I couldn't find it anywhere. But apparently we've got 200 million in the bank. Um, oh, no, we had 250. In my head, for some reason, I thought we had an injection of money, but we haven't. We're actually less money. But we've still got 200 million in the bank, so I can't really complain with that. I'm going to improve. Uh, nope. Uh, call for an, ask for an affiliate. See if we can get one. Yep. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Right. So here we go. Here's our starting lineup now. So we've got Patterson in goal. Defense as usual. Mal uh, Marmo in there, though. 
Laird on the left, Norton Cuffey on the right, uh, Alanini and Garner in midfield. Dosi on the left, later on the right, Marshall up front. Is Zumbo, is Lumbo, Lazumbo? I can't remember his name now. Zito Lavumbo, is he back yet? No, he's still injured. Okay. So, right, let's see what we can do against Southampton in the uh, last, last game of the episode. After I finish this, I'll probably have about 10 minutes before I have to start, before I start streaming on Twitch. I'm not complaining, by the way. Um, just like I said, eventually I'll get it um, just right where I'm recording a few episodes one day and then editing them the next day. So it still gives me time for myself as well. But yeah, I'm enjoying the, the whole process. I'm enjoying the interaction with people. I'm enjoying making content and also enjoying just being in a routine and improving, um, ups, upskilling, as they say, improving on my skills when it comes to video editing and stuff like that. Um, trying to improve as a personality on YouTube and stuff. I hope that people like my style, what is, you know, how I talk and stuff like that. Um, great little ball there to Martial. Martial now, can he break, can he break the defence down? He gives it to Laird, Laird in the middle. Look at El, oh, Elanini, I thought he was going to blast that in there. But yeah, I just hope I'm coming across in the right, in the right way and stuff, but yeah. I think it's just me just being paranoid, thinking I'm annoying people all the time. Right, Garner to Goffrey. Goffrey to Norton Cuffey to Marmar. We're trying to get every player a, a, a pass here by the looks of it. Laird now. Good little team goal if this goes in. Don't know what the hell happened there. Laird just went so far and just went, oh, I can't be bothered to keep going. Play for set pieces. Right, free kick to us now. See what cool, uh, Garner can do. Can he, get a, can he score from this range? We'll soon find out. Or is he going to go for an indirect one and loop it into the box? I think he's going to go for a goal here. I think he's going to go shoot. Oh, I think that hit the bar then. Not the bar, sorry. I think that hit the post. Right, so that's the end of the first half. Nil nil. Let's encourage the players to see what we can do. Free kick to Southampton straight away, though. That's quite concerning. Laird now. Can he break forward with the counter-attack? Run, run, run. Run, Laird, run. Switches it all the way over to Lado with a lovely little pass. Lado now with the cross. Yes. Go on, Martial. Eight goal of the season for Martial. Get in. How many goals has he got now? Eight goals. Um, eight goals in 11 games. So he's... He's uh, improving his um, goal, goal ratio. So, yeah, so hopefully he'll get... I'm hoping he gets, like, 20 goals for the season. I'll be happy with that. Definitely our top, uh, top striker at the moment. Um, while we're in the championship, I don't think we're going to get a better striker than Martial. I think we're doing exceptionally well to get Martial in. Ah. Oh. Tay Adams was actually a striker I was looking at to bring to Everton, to be honest. But that's mostly because I'm half Scottish and I'm a bit biased, so I tried to probably try to bring him in for that reason. Plus, also he's um, he's, he's he's a pretty good striker, to be honest. There's a reason why he's playing for Scotland. Right, Alanini, put the carry on, Laird. Uh, no one can come on for there because he's the only left back there. Right. Off a dosi. Can't take off a dosi for the same reason because we haven't got anybody in there. Considering we've got such a big squad, it's ridiculous that we haven't got players that can do these positions. Right, Malmo will have to go there. And then put this on. Uh, we'll leave that for now. Uh, what we can do. Sorry about that. Right. Is it going to end on one? It does. Not ideal, but like I said, we didn't lose. That's all. That's what's important. Still in there with a the shout. We've, we've gone down to third, though. Um, we're only three points behind Sheffield United, though. 
Right then. So that's the end of that then. That's the end of today. Um, thank you for following me as always. I appreciate it. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for subscribing. Feel free to like the video and subscribe just to let me know that you do, you do like it and also let me know that you are interested in the content I'm bringing. Um, like I said, check me out on Twitter, Lucha FM. I'll be posting when I'm streaming next and things like that. And Facebook as well, Lucha FM as well. Uh, if anybody knows of any good football manager Facebook groups, Discord servers or Reddit pages, I've, I've, I've been on a few last night. If anybody's got any more, the more the better. Um, but yeah, on that note, I shall leave you to it. Have a nice rest of your day and all the best. And thank you again.